Oh, good afternoon and welcome to another North Wales side by side video. What I'm going to do in this video is my timing chain tensioner. So I'm just going to go through the procedure for doing it with you because it's not a hard job. First, you need to remove all the electrical connections and this breather pipe. So I've already unclipped the coil connectors. Next I'm going to remove the coils. And then the rocker cover can come off the top of the YXZ. So the first stage was remove the six bolts that hold the coil packs in. So they've all been removed. And there's the three coils in order. I'm going to keep them in order. So next I need to crack these four. I've already taken the breather off. Then I can take the rocker cover off. And then I can show you the next stage. So I've now removed the four retaining bolts and they were 5mm hex. The bolts that hold the coil packs on are 10mm. So let's see if I can get the rocker cover off. Well, it's nice and clean in there. Most impressed. So I'm just going to put all the nuts and bolts to one side. Now I'm in, and then I'm going to go and take the plug out the end and set the cam timing. Now the next thing you need to remove is this big donger and that one there, but I'm not removing that one. I'm going to remove that one so I can turn the engine and you've got to turn it clockwise. And then I'm going to watch the cam lobes and the timing marks on the cam wheels up there. That's where I'm going to do it. Then I'm going to zip tie the chain to the sprocket, take the old tensioner off. Right, so what I've just done now is rotate the engine. And I've lined up all the marks on the camshaft gear. So there all where they need to be. So I'm just going to lock off the chain with zip tie so it doesn't come off. And I take the tension off and it stays put. And then I'm going for the timing chain tensioner. So I've zip tied the chain on to the sprocket just in case. Now I'm going for timing chain tensioner. And that's held on with two M6 bolts on there, 5mm hex or Allen. So that's the next item I'm going to remove now. I'll show you it when I take it off. Okay, I got disturbed whilst I was doing the job, so I've not done all the filming. The old tensioner's out. And the new manual tensioner is now back in. We've spun the engine over about six times. I've just double checked the timing marks. They've all lined up again. So I'm ready to reassemble. And do the fine tuning on the tension. I think I've got my chain a little bit tight at the moment, but I can slacken it off. It's easy to do now. 
So I'm going to throw it back together and uh, then I'm going to fire it up and I'll bring you along for that. But the job is so easy. 10 millimeter socket, 5 mil Allen key, 19 mil socket and a 10 millimeter Allen key. That's all you need to do the job. Right, we're all buttoned up. Tensioners on. Chains adjusted for now. Coils are back in, wires are back on, breather's back on, rocker covers fastened down. Now the scary bit, starting it. Even though I've turned it over about six times. there's no nasty rattles it needs to be taken out now I'll take the tools with me and I need to get it nice and warm and then set the final tension on that timing chain all I need to take with me 17 millimeter and a six millimeter so I'll take them two tools with me I'm gonna tidy up now put all the rest away and then we're gonna take her for our ballast and once it's warm, see what it sounds like. <laughs> 